Booming. Uh, well, all right, we've been waiting for this story all morning, and here it is. A new way to shed excess fat without the traditional liposuction could soon be coming to the United States. A test of a non-invasive procedure, no cutting, no needles, no incisions, nothing, that uses ultrasound to break down fat. This thing is coming to a store near you at some point. Dr. Jennifer Walden is a plastic surgeon at Lenox Hill Hospital. She joins us live from our New York Hi, Megan. Good morning, doctor. All right, morning. so I heard about this and I was like, oh, I heard of this. This is that smart lipo that's, you know, a laser and it's not as invasive. It's not that. It's it, not. It's no incisions whatsoever. Tell us how this thing works. Right, and I rarely say this, but this is the real deal. This is going to be the next best thing since sliced bread and cosmetic procedures. It's an external ultrasound that requires no incisions, no recovery that melts fat and the body normally metabolizes it just as it would a fatty meal and you get skinnier. How many times do you have to go to get the, the desired result? Well, optimally three to four treatments spaced three weeks apart will produce about two to three inches of loss in the circumference or in your waistline. And these are peer-reviewed, multi-centered trials in clinical trials pending review by the FDA. And so we think this is actually going to go through and get approved by the FDA. It's been used in 50 countries so far. All right. So I decide I want to have take, t a little taken off the thigh. I go for three times, 30 minutes a shot, maybe four times, 30 minutes a shot. I right. sit under the machine. No incisions, just like a little massage, I guess. Right, exactly. And, and then I've lost three inches or, or thereabouts after, after those treatments. How much am I going to have to pay for each of these treatments, and is it safe? It's basically going to be around $400 to $1,000 a treatment, so that can add up to about the cost of one liposuction procedure. But hey, it's non-invasive, it's non-painful, no anesthesia. You can put your jeans back on and walk out in your skin air, by the way, because there are immediate results within 14 days. And the studies have shown by basic scientists, say at UT Southwestern, one of my colleagues has been involved in the clinical trials, that the basic science is there and that it is safe and efficacious. And the body just normally recognizes fat the acid, which is broken down by the fat cells that are melted, and it metabolizes them through the liver. Okay, but is this bad for your liver to suddenly have all this fat going through it? That you know, it's like you eat a cheeseburger. That's one thing, but you have three inches burned off by this machine, is your liver overwhelmed? Are there risks there? No, because it's really intended for average to moderately overweight individuals with um, stubborn fat pockets. It's not a method of weight loss. And so for small treatment areas like the love handles, the thighs, those will get melted down and the body recognizes it just as it would recognize a Big Mac. And we can metabolize Big Macs. Now we couldn't do that every day for 20 days over a large surface area of the body, but no, no one will be trained and no one will be able to do that or misuse the machine that way. Way. All right, now I'm told that it is already being used in Canada, Japan, uh, much of Europe. Fifty countries are already doing this. Unfortunately, not the United States yet. I know. Uh, but tens of thousands of people have been treated with this. Have there been any significant problems with it? From studies of 164 people, they, two people had small blisters that resolved. Some people have transient erythema or redness of the skin that goes away within about an hour. But it doesn't affect anything deeper than the below the skin layer of the fat. It doesn't affect internal organs. It doesn't cause the bleeding that liposuction can cause. And so we haven't seen many side effects at all, which when, is the When is it coming? Thing. I want it now. <laughs> right. Can we get it in my I office? mean, in two weeks, you could be down a gene size. I love it. When I is know. it getting here? It will be mass appeal. It will change the face of cosmetic procedures in the United States. What do you think? A year, five Probably, years? Well, I think the FDA likes to scrutinize very hard, like they did silicone breast implants. So we're the last in the world to get it, as usual. But probably within two years is what they're saying. And unfortunately, phase three can last years. Phase three, which is where they're, what they're in now. Right. Yeah, the, in the last stage of clinical trials. But well, at least it's gotten that far, so we think it will be approved because it, it is safe. It is nice to think about, at least, the thought of losing it's a few nice inches around your waistline or whatever. <laughs> Just sit under the machine and then you're off. Yeah, Dr. Absolutely. Jennifer Walden, thank you thank so you. much. Thanks, Megan. We have a hooey vote around here, right? Where you can vote hooey? You think it's hooey? Right. Can, can, I, can I exercise my yes, hooey you can. vote? You can. That's hooey. Why? I don't believe it. Come Why on. Because it's too easy. It's too good to be true. Come on. It sounds like, you know what? It's a Ponzi scheme. That's what it is. They're doing it all over the world. William Sonoma's incredibly popular.